So in this lesson guys, I'm going to tell you about how to manage your comments that are inserted by the one who is proofreading or editing your document. So once you're done with this document and send it for proofreading, the one who is proofreading your document may add some comments that you need to modify this document such as he may add a comment that bold this particular line of text or word and put it in italics, give it, give one line space, add a new paragraph and so on. So first of all, in the previous lessons in module 2, I demonstrated how you can add comments and how can you reply to the comments and so on. And now I'm going to tell you that how you can manage those comments. So first of all, we'll go to review over here. And you can see that we have the comment section on its own so only one option is available over here which is insert a comment add a note about this part of the document and the other options are blurred because we don't have a comment up till now and we cannot delete a comment because not a single comment exists we cannot move to the previous one we cannot move to the next one and we cannot also sh show the comment because we don't have any so let's insert a comment over here so first we need to highlight a piece of text for example let's highlight this internet of things and new comment so at this place I can add a comment or the proofreader ad will add a comment let's say so the comment will be please bold this text as well great now a person has added a comment let's assume and he also adds a comment over here recognize that add new comment that please increase the size of this word or let's say increase the font size of this word okay great so now I have two comments on this word document and moving on with the first comment for now I can either reply to this comment or resolve this comment so I can if I re click reply to this comment it will create a new thread under this comment that I can reply so I can bold this first over here let's bold this text control plus B and then I can add a comment done and once I've done this I can simply right click and you can see that I have these options printed over here reply co to comment delete comment or resolve comment so either I can do it from here or I can do it from here it's the same thing now moving on with the next comment on my word document the word is recognized and I need to increase the font size of this word so highlight increase the font size to I'll increase it to 12 let's say and I can again reply to this comment as done and click away and you have successfully re replied to all of these comments over here which means that you have managed your comments and went to each comment and did what it said exactly so similarly if you have a new comment that please insert a new paragraph in this text explaining what you have written over here you have to do that and you can simply write down as well over there so this is how you can manage your comments efficiently and easily and this is how you can work proficiently with word 2016 so i hope you enjoyed i hope you like this lesson this was just a recap of what we did in one of our previous lessons in which I told you that how you can insert comments. So stay tuned, stay focused and let's move to our 
next lesson